Welcome to Marchant Chevrolet Videos. No nonsense needed at all. This next video is just for you. Hey everybody, welcome to Marchant Chevrolet Videos and today we're going to be taking a look at a pre-owned 2014 Chevy Volt. Stay tuned over the next few minutes as we take a look at this really cool vehicle. That's right, all electric, the Chevy Volt. We've all heard of it before and we don't see a whole lot of pre-owned ones here at the dealership very often. So let's take a look. If I see any dents, dings, or scratches on the Volt, I'll point them out to you today. Again, this is a pre-owned condition report about this vehicle at Marchant Chevrolet. So stay tuned over the next few minutes. We'll look at price, mileage, and specs, and all that good stuff. So, so far, right here on the front end, it's looking good. I'm liking the color on here. I've seen a lot of Chevy Volts in that silver color, but I'm liking this. It's a little different, isn't it? You got your projector headlamps. The car's running right now, nice and quiet, like any electric car just so quiet. I mean, you could pull out of your neighborhood at night and just nobody really hear you, right? That's really pretty cool. But the main thing is, is you don't have to get over expensed with fuel economy and paying for gas and all that kind of thing. Just plug it up in the house, have a good time, hit the road, and we'll see you back a little bit later. So, so far, front end's looking good. It's in good shape. Let's look at our wheels right here for just a minute. You do got Goodyear tires, and uh, let's look at the alloys here. They're 17 inch in size, so you got a 215, 55, 17. Wheels look good, no problem there. This is where you will plug in to be able to charge your vehicle up at your house in your garage or however you do that. And you know, if you live in the Carolinas here, to believe it or not, at the Tanger Outlets up there, there's a lot of charging stations around town. Just ask the guys inside the store in there, they'll let you know where they're at. So you can, if you're out on the road and you need to get a little bit of uh, power, you can do that. So, so far the body's in great shape. Again, 2014 volt. Pretty neat little car. Let us know in the comments on YouTube if you're watching from there right now. What do you think about a Chevy Volt? Have you driven one? Have you owned one? Let us know. And uh, yeah, and most importantly, if you're looking to buy one, well, here's one pre-owned at Marchant Chevy. We don't get a whole lot of these. This is the first pre-owned one I've ever filmed on my channel. Tail lights look good. Let's take a look in the back. There's that cool looking Volt logo. And let's go ahead and open this up. So it is a hatchback vehicle, as you can see right there. You got a decent amount of trunk space in the back, as you can see. This right here, this is what you're going to be charging with right there at the house. Your floor mat looks good. The condition's really nice on this vehicle, but again, that's what you plug into the car right there. Boom, that plugs in right there at the house. I mean, how about that? Does that get any easier? No, it doesn't. That's easy. You do got rear seats, as you can see. Now, let's go ahead and, uh, and take a look at the front and the dash and all that kind of thing. So far, the car's in really good shape. No dents, dings, or scratches of any kind that I've seen so far on the exterior paint. Now, this one does uh, have 24,724, so take a look at that. 24,724 on the mileage. So, you know, there we go. Uh, the price is 16478 so that's a great price for an electric car. You can't beat that, folks. So great price, great mileage on this car, and then it also is certified pre-owned, so it's gonna come with a ton of additional warranty by Chevrolet. And uh, they sometimes they say, don't say warranty, we'll call it a service contract. But also with a CPO vehicle, folks, there's a lot of stuff they do in the shop with a CPO car that makes it that way. So there's a big inspection that goes on and test drives and all kind of things to make a certified pre-owned car close as they can to a new vehicle okay um, I like the black I like the chrome and then the color it looks pretty sweet not bad at all here's your door panel nice and clean it does have power windows power door locks power mirrors there's your it's got gas I guess it does take a little bit of gas probably but it's not running on fuel right now that I know of. Here's your seats. No leather in this particular car. This one's got the cloth interior seating. I can't tell you the AC is nice and cold blowing in here right now. Let's go ahead and hop in. You do got your rubber floor mats though. No power seats though. This is just a uh, manual seat. Ugh. Now the, um, I gotta drop the seat down a little bit. Because I bumped my head right there just now when I was getting in the vehicle, and that didn't feel too good. And, you know, I'm about 6'2", so the seat was pretty much all the way up. As you can see, I'm pushing that seat down right now. 
because that might have helped in that particular situation so you don't bump your head getting in the car. Leather wrapped steering wheel, not bad. Feels good. Cruise control, audio controls, Bluetooth cell phone system. Of course, with any electric vehicle, you're definitely probably going to want to have some kind of electric looking dash. It's all digital, high definition, as you can see right there. And that gives you a lot of good information about this vehicle right in that area there. So when you're driving the Chevy Volt, you know, all your information you need about power and, you know, all that kind of stuff is going to be right there. And it'll let you know, you know, how fast you're going. Anyways, all that kind of stuff right there. And it does, as you can see at the top, have a little gas thing saying 69 miles, 21 miles off the uh, actual uh, energy with the vehicle. Total range uh, 91, so something like that. Anyways, um, here is your, uh, another, your second display screen there, which could have your navigation and all that kind of stuff. You do got a little storage compartment up there with a 12 volt to plug and play. That's a great spot. I like that they got a 12 volt right there outlet so you can plug in a Garmin or, you know, or anything that you need to put on the dash like your phone or something like that. Um, you just click these things here to do your climate controls. Fan speed over there. See, we'll drop it down a little bit because it's kind of loud. But there you have that. Your power button is right there. That's how you're going to cut the car on when you get in with the key. There's your shifter. Park brake is over here on the right. Electronic park brake. Here's your key. Nothing real sporty or different about the key. It's just like about any other Chevy back in 2014. But it does have some little power buttons there. And then you got cup holders, storage, seats are in great shape. Overall condition's good. Still got your OnStar, still got your home link up top. No sunglass holders that I can find. You do have your interior lighting and all that good stuff right there. Let's hop out real quick, take a look in the back seats, see what we got going on in the rear. Now again, you know, I am six foot two. I put my seat all the way back. So there's not really a whole lot of leg room there for someone that's super tall. But you know, you got plenty of room to push that seat forward if you got the kids riding in the back or friends and things like that, okay? So don't take that. I mean, it is tight fit. I will not lie to you there. It is a tight fit. Look at that. But again, you're looking at a car where the seats are literally all the way pushed back right now. So it's not leaving much room in the rear. But this is the rear of the car. You got a little storage compartments there. Another little 12 volt. You got your, uh, your cup holders. I don't see any rear air vents for, you know, cool AC in the back. But I'm sure with all the vents you got up front there, that's going to be plenty enough uh, cool air coming back to keep you nice and cool in the hot summer heat right here in the Carolinas. So that's it, folks, right here at Marchant Chevrolet car still running when you got the key in your hand it'll do a little honk like that at you but very clean conditions great cpo vehicle at marchant chevy it won't last long right here at marchant chevy so come on down and see them if you're watching on youtube let me know what do you think in the comments of this particular chevy volt and uh, let me know what you think about the volt if you drive one now and uh you know just comments are they're always helpful to have hit the thumbs up button if you enjoyed watching this quick little uh, review about this pre-owned volt at marchant chevy and once again no deal rabbit fees no dog fees of any kind at marchant chevrolet just good old carbine we look forward to seeing you right here in the carolinas today's april 4th 2017 so if you're watching this video two three four years later well the car's not here anymore folks but you did get to see a 2014 volt on our channel have a great day we'll see you soon i'm signing out Thanks for watching with us. Remember, car buying made easy at Marchant Chevrolet. Make sure you subscribe, like, and comment today for more videos.